make waffles without pancake mix. What is up you guys? Welcome and welcome back to my channel. My name is Mahogany if you are new here. And if you are not, then you already know. Today is Vlogtober day number 14, I believe. Let me check. Yep. Day number 14. And in today's video, we're going to be making pumpkin pancakes and mimosas. I was thinking about doing like a Halloween themed mimosa, but I'm not sure yet. So we're just going to see. Um, so right now I'm at Target. i seen on TikTok that Target has like these waffle makers and it's shaped as a pumpkin. So I'm going to either see if I can find something like that, find a pumpkin cutout, or we might just be doing like pumpkin flavored uh, pancakes. So yeah, that's what we're about to do. And if Target doesn't work, I'll probably go to Hobby Lobby or I think it's a Michaels or something right here. Um, so yeah, we're about to see what we can do. So let's get into it. Y'all look at these. Like, why would I not buy this? You could do like a chips and dip type of night or something like that. I'm going to get some. Why did I just find it? It's right here. And I found it right there, you know, on the corner of the aisle. Okay, y'all, so I just left Target. Um, I'm getting ready to go into this store. It's called Pop Shelf. I have been wanting to see what's up in here for, like, a couple years. And they have one where I live at now. So we're going to see what they got in there. And also, I still need to give me, like, a cute mimosa glass. Love yours. No such thing. No such thing as a life that's better than yours. No such thing as a life that's better than yours. Love yours. No such thing as a life that's better than yours. No such thing. No such thing. Heart beating fast. Let a nigga know that he alive. Make niggas mad. Make snakes in the grass. Let a nigga know that he alive. I just got back home. It is. 2 30 and i know this is supposed to be brunch and brunch is almost over but it's gonna be it's not gonna be over until i say it's over so yeah let me just go ahead and show y'all what i got from the store i did get some stuff from pop show um i will show y'all the decorations probably from pop show i didn't get that much but i'm definitely going back it was very affordable and nice looking stuff so i'm gonna go back but yeah i'm gonna show y'all that at the end or something but i'm about to go through the little stuff that we're using for brunch today so if you wanted to cook brunch with me you can wait till tomorrow for brunch again brunch hours again or yeah but anyway from target i showed y'all the uh pumpkin waffle maker so get you one it was ten dollars uh, when i got to target i also showed y'all these little platters i got it was cheap it was just something if i wanted to do like like i said earlier like guacamole salsa Something like that, like a little movie, another movie night or whatever. I could use these. They also had some leaf ones. I really just bought this to buy it, but I could like spread these around the apartment and put like little candy on it or something. You know, just some fall decorations to get in the spirit. Okay, so first of all, if you don't know that in my um, spooky drink video that I needed food coloring, then you need to go back and watch that drink video because why don't you know? But anyway, I found real food coloring at target so cheers to that we making another spooky drink and we making um jello shots coming soon so from michael's y'all i just went everywhere today like i don't know but anyway from michael's they was having like um 50 off all their halloween stuff so i got like a little mold here and i actually think i'll make some jello shots with this and then i also got a mold of like skeletons i think skeleton head skulls um so i'll make jello shots with these like i said coming soon i also got like a little what's this thing called i should know you know the little scientist cup whatever but yeah i don't know what i'm gonna use this for i kind of got an idea but stay tuned like i said i went to like so many stores to try to find this specific pumpkin glass that i was looking for i could not find it but i found something else from home goods you can always rely on home goods to come through it's another like glass and it has a little pumpkin at the bottom i don't know if y'all can see that but yes this will this is what we'll be using today for our mimosas i lied i did have more stuff from target it was just so much stuff in target that was affordable and i'm like why not you know but i got this little cute um like halloween teacup 
I'm gonna be using this. I also got like a little ghost platter. All of this stuff is cheap, y'all. So if y'all wanted to just spice up y'all day and just do something for no reason, then you can go buy some cheap stuff and make, you know, just make um, a day of Halloween festivities or whatever you want to do. I also got a um, happy Halloween plate. So I am so frustrated. How you? How are you gonna make waffles without pancake mix? Seriously, like I have to go back to Walmart. It's not far, but I literally said, I hope I don't forget nothing. I hope I don't forget nothing. Obviously y'all see I've been riding around all day. So I'm gonna just shut up. I'm gonna go get the pancake mix. And after that, we just gonna get started because by the time this food is done, it's gonna be dinner time. Finally made it back. The first thing I'm gonna do is wash my chicken because that's gonna take the longest between the fryer um, heating up and me seasoning and all that and then after that everything should just flow and i'm anticipating being done with this by 3 45 and it's three right three right now so shouldn't take that long today to season our chicken we're going to be using slap your mama and we'll be using lemon pepper seasoning so I'm gonna season the chicken and I'm gonna transfer it to another plate. I just guess how much I wanna season. This really nothing to it. Just shake some seasoning on there. And I don't need super, super seasoned chicken. So I just. Now that my fryer is ready, I'm gonna set a timer for 10 minutes. And I'm gonna cook these. And while these are cooking, I'm literally gonna work on everything else. And I'm gonna try to be done within 15 minutes. Here's the pancake mix I'm gonna be using today. I'm just really gonna eye it. Um, I was also supposed to get some milk, but I didn't, so we're going to have to use water today. That's okay. It's going to be the first time that somebody ate pancakes with water. That really should be enough. I'm going to put an egg in here. I'm going to add um, some vanilla extract as well. Water. Start off with a little bit, then mix. The chicken is now done. Now I'm just waiting on my um, waffle maker to get hot, make the waffles, eggs, and then we cut up our strawberries, and we're all ready. So while the rest of those waffles are um, working, I'm gonna go ahead and get these eggs started. I like my eggs scrambled, so I'm just gonna do um, scrambled eggs with salt and pepper. This is how I cook mine, like in the pot like this. I don't mix them up beforehand, but I will scramble them in the pan. Alrighty, so now it's time for plating. I already got the eggs on there, as you can see. I think I'm gonna do the chicken down the middle. The waffles on the side. I'm gonna do some powdered sugar, the getaway. And then I'm gonna place our strawberries. Just throw them in there, make it look cute. Now that we have our food plated and everything, it is time to make our mimosa so we can finally sit down and eat. So y'all already know, 
know that the food is good. I mean, I'm working on it. I ate one piece of chicken and some eggs, but it's, it's breakfast food. How can you mess up breakfast food? You can't. So, matter of fact, let me taste this um waffle right quick, make sure it's all the way done. Yeah, it's done. Um, the waffle maker ain't gonna lie. It did not take long at all to cook them waffles. So, wait, hold on, let me actually try to taste this. I will put more vanilla. It could use some more vanilla in there. Um, I will also put cheese in my eggs next time. You know, to add a little razzle dazzle. Um, but yeah, everything's good. Hopefully, y'all can recreate the um, the breakfast I made. I told y'all where to get everything. But um, if you stay to the end of the video, you already know what to do. If you like the video, please leave a like. And if you like me, then subscribe. And other than that, I will see y'all in my next video. Bye.